10 second violation called against the Terriers. The head coach for St. Francis is not exactly happy about the call. It was a 10 second violation. 66 63 is your score. Norfolk State trailing by three with 7.56 left to go here in the second half. Norfolk State will have the basketball as Fuentes gets the feed from Hawkins, who's on the floor with Chris Brown, Rob Johnson, and Brandon Good. Ball screen as Brown kicks it off to Fuentes. Still driving the lane with the right hand. Kicks out Johnson. Johnson out to Brown. Brown thinks about the three. Dribbles off his foot. Picks up his dribble. Kicks it off to Hawkins with 15 on the shot clock. With the basketball now. Here's Hawkins. Looks up at the shot clock. Kicks it off to Brandon Good. Good working on the baseline. Gets into lane. Lays up with the left handing Good. Brandon Good falls into a layup. He now has nine points and with 7.22 left to go here in the second half. The Spartans trailing by 166-65. Isolovich with the basketball. He brings it up. The court kicks it cross court to King Johnson. Johnson gets the ball poked away by Malcolm Hawkins. It's going to be saved in, but Jones is going to find it. The ball is going to be poked away. Last touch. As one official says, Norfolk State. One official says, St. Francis. Let's see who the ball basketball goes over to. And it's going to be a 10-second violation again on St. Francis as the ball did not cross half court. 7.07 left to go here in the second half. And another question by the head coach of St. Francis, Glenn Breaker. And the question is going to be answered by the officials after they have a conference. matter is the basketball is going to belong to Norfolk State. The second straight 10 second violation for St. Francis. Norfolk State will have the basketball inbound pass comes to Fuentes. Fuentes with it guarded closely by Jones. Man to man defense by St. Francis. Fuentes looking for a screen. Gets it with the right hand dribble. Drives kicks it off to Rob Johnson. Johnson looking inside ball knocked away last touch by the Terriers. 19 seconds on the shot clock, 6.51 left to go here in the second half. The Spartans trailing by one, 66-65. Good gets the inbounds pass. Kicks it off to Fuentes. Spin move by Fuentes. Kicks it off to Hawkins. Back to Fuentes, right wing. Quicks it cross court to Chris Brown. He steps into a three. He takes it. Inch, inches out. Rebound knocked out of bounds. Last touch by Rob Johnson and the Spartans. Good look there by Chris Brown. Just couldn't knock it down. That place with, This place would have erupted if that would have all in with 6.39 left to go here in the second half. Norfolk State trailing by one. Inbound pass comes to Cannon. Cannon off to Jones. Jones back to Cannon. Cannon into the front court. Gets into the lane. Lays it up with the right hand. Short. Rebound comes down to Chris Brown. Brown in the backcourt. Gets into the hands of Rob Johnson. He drives his back and he's going to be fouled. And going to the free throw line for two will be the Spartans' Rob Johnson. It's an opportunity to give the Spartans a one point advantage. If he can knock down two, he has 12 points tonight to lead the Spartans in scoring. They'll put Rob Johnson at the free throw line. As the Spartans trail by one after trailing by 11, 61 to 50, the Spartans have brought it back to a one point ball game. It's been a 15 to five run for the Spartans. As Johnson can tie it with the free throw here. First free throw up, knocks it down. He has 13. It's a 66-66 ball game. Second shot coming up for Rob Johnson. It is up, and the Spartans retake the lead at 67-66. 6.24 left. With the basketball now, here's Douglas, and the Spartans foul him in the backcourt. That's going to go against Chris Brown. That's going to be three on Chris. And that's going to be the 15 foul for the Spartans. 6.20 left to go. Douglas will trigger the inbound. Gets it into Jones. Jones in the middle of the floor. Brings it into the front court now with the right hand. The Northeast Conference member, St. Francis, Brooklyn, trailing by 167-66. Basketball's in the hands of Jones. Nice defense there by Hawkins. As Jones has it. He drives, gets into the lane, puts up the floater off glass, and good. Tough play by Jones. He has six, and the Spartans now trail again by 168-67. Here's Fuentes. Fuentes lifts the drive, gets cut off. Now he will drive with the right hand. Gets into the lane, travels, but he lays it up and good. Fuentes now with 13. He's tied for the team high with Rob Johnson and is now a one-point 
lead 69-68. Back comes Jones. He fires along too. And misses a badly. Rebound knocked into the hands of Rob Johnson. Johnson will quickly get it off to Fuentes. Goes behind his back. Fuentes into the lane. Kicks it off to be good. He'll slam it home for the Spartans. Brandon Good with 11 and the Spartans now up by 3. 71-68. 520 left to go here in the second half. And a timeout is going to be taken by... St. Francis of Brooklyn and the Spartans. 